Sooner Scoop HD. Josh McQuistion of SoonerScoop.com here with Rivals 100 defensive end commitment, Colton Vosick. Colton, really seemed like they did a lot tonight to kind of just slow you down, kind of anything they could do. Still had some big plays in that one. What, you know, what does this game mean, I mean, to you as a, a Westlake guy in your senior year? I mean, this game is huge to us. This, I mean, this is the biggest rivalry in all of high school football, in our opinion. I mean, we take this stuff seriously, and we just stay true with each other. We had a slow start, but we finished strong like we should. Now, for you guys, the defense, I mean, you really did a nice job most of the night bottling them up. Kind of, you know, I think they had a few moments they put some drives together, that kind of thing. What, when those things are going on and you're, you know, like I said, you're getting chipped and you're, like, how are you staying, okay, I got to be play to play. I got to, you know, kind of forget and move to the next thing. How do you kind of stay mentally focused? Just my desire to win, you know, I never want to let my teammates down. I never want to be the reason that our team loses, so do everything I can to help our team win. Obviously, Coach Chavis here didn't really try to hide his presence at all. Uh, I don't think he could if he had to. But, um, you know, what's that mean to ha you know have a few of you guys down here watching on a big night like this? Yeah, it means a lot for him to come down and show some support. Uh, biggest game of the year. It's, it's huge. It means a lot. <laughs> I, I guess, now you know, I got to ask. A couple weeks ago, everybody gets all excited. You know, you go to the Texas game. Run everybody through that. I mean, I know you and I have talked a little bit about it. I've taught you to add a little bit. I mean, what, what's that like for you? And, you know, what was your reaction to everybody kind of getting so excited about it? Yeah, so Bama came to my backyard. I really just want to go see a good game. You know, I got free tickets. But, <laughs> I mean, I'm locked in, you know. I'm locked in with OU forever. Okay, okay. Now, I, I will say for everybody listening to this, there was a Oklahoma call for the picture with the family after the game. So, we, we can we can take that uh seriously but I guess just kind of final question man I know uh, you know I know you had talked about going up there tomorrow I know that's not going to happen do you know when your you know next trip's coming up yeah so I'll be at the uh, Texas OU game in okay. Dallas and then I believe my mom is looking at trips to go to that Baylor game I'm not sure what time it'll be yet but it'll be at OU now how weird is it going to be watching OU Texas and cheering for the other direction on that it'll man? be weird for sure <laughs> but I mean I've been watching OU closely I mean I've been pulling for them all year I don't want Texas to win that game at all. So. Okay. Now, and I keep saying last question. Really, the last one. You've had a chance to watch a few OU games, I'm sure. What have you thought of their performances so far? I think they played great, that Nebraska game. Defense played great. Offense played great. It was a great uh, atmosphere at the Cornhusker Stadium. Mm -hmm. And I think they did everything they did to win. Perfect. Well, again, this has been Joshua Christian of Studerscoop.com here with Colton Vosick. Sooner Scoop HD.